Good morning. Welcome to Worship and Wonder. I'm Sarah Hinesley. Let's begin with our song, Be Still and Know. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. This is the Sea of Galilee. This sea was so important in many of the tales of Jesus that we had to have a piece of it here in our worship center. The sea is a strange and wonderful place. When the wind is strong, the waves can be rough and wild. But when the wind is calm, the sea is peaceful and still. After God raised Jesus from the dead, the 11 disciples came to the mountain in Galilee as Jesus had instructed them to do. When they saw Jesus, they worshipped him, although some doubted. Then Jesus said, I am sending you to the whole world to do what I have done and to show everyone the way of the kingdom of God. I am commissioning you to do this. Then Jesus said these special words to them. All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Go, therefore, and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything that I have commanded you. And remember, I am with you always to the end of the age. Then, when the disciples received the Holy Spirit, they were filled with so much love that they did everything that he asked them to do. They cast out evil spirits. They healed the sick. They encouraged the poor. They enjoyed the children. And they did this in Jerusalem and in Judea and in Samaria and in all the nations, showing the way of the kingdom of God and baptizing everyone who would follow Jesus. Hmm. I wonder why some believed Jesus when they saw him, believed that it was him, and others doubted. I wonder how they feel when Jesus commissions them to go out into the world and to show everyone the way of the kingdom of God. I wonder if they still 
believed that Jesus was with them even when he, they could not see him. Hmm. And I wonder how they feel when Jesus says, Remember, I will be with you always to the end of the age. The words that Jesus said have a special name. It is called the Great Commission. The Great Commission is for us too. From Matthew 28, verses 18 through 20, it says, All authority in heaven and earth has been given to me. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything that I have commanded you. And remember, I am with you always to the end of the age. This commission is for everyone, even for you today. These words are so important. The church and always says these words to people who will follow Jesus and say the words that Jesus wanted them to say about spreading the kingdom of God. The scripture this, this week is from Matthew 28, verses 16 through 20, and also from Mark chapter 16, verses 15 through 18. You may wish to look these stories up in your Bible at home or on your, on your iPad or your computer. And encourage you to follow through with a, an art project or a story writing or whatever it is you would like to do to make this story come alive for you after the service or during the service. Let us pray together. Dear God, thank you for Jesus for him showing us the way of the kingdom of God and for giving us the courage to go into the world to all nations and to, to know that he is always with us, even to the end of the age. Bless us this week as we work and study and play. Heal our country and our world, O oh Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.